way to go. I love my oh yeah. I to yes, I want to. I like disappoint to Ian came confusion. Hey, baby, mm. um, this is what I'm, I'm, I'm beginning to wonder why Nigeria's why it's taking Nigeria's long to release this song. I mean, we are that creative. We are. Never mind, we are here to do the talk again on the brew ha, concerning the 2019 general election when it comes to the postponing of the 2019 general election. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, a lot of drama went down from COP members having to sleep on the harsh weather conditions to the statement released by INEC, which by the way someone said there was no atom of apology. Ah, disrespect. That I would not want to be about the way. But based on logistics, we can't keep on recounting these issues as happened over time. But then we need to go see that Koro Koro ice. Following a careful review of the implementation of its logistics and operational plan and the determination to conduct free, fair and credible elections, the Commission came to the conclusion that proceeding with the election as scheduled is no longer feasible. This will afford the Commission the opportunity to address identified challenges in order to maintain the quality of our elections. This was a difficult decision for the Commission to take, but necessary for the successful delivery of elections and the consolidation of our democracy. Now, like we always do on 2019 Weekly, we'll have to go chill out with some of Nigerians' reactions to postponing the elections. At Miss Judith says, INEC postpones election after four years of planning. Nigeria will always be Nigeria. It's just pathetic. Well, my sister, this is the best song for us right now. And at Sal Leo B. De Silva tweeted, INEC, you always have four years to prepare for COP as being used for elections. All the money gotten for elections, why can't you provide suitable accommodation for a night? Why do you treat graduates like this? Is it a crime to serve Nigeria? <laughs> Bro, it's like he hasn't heard the, the NYC anthem. <laughs> Maybe that is just what it is. Now, while we are still trying to calm the stormy ways of postponing the general elections, another, another serious bagam came in. And you trust Nigerians? We dive into action. Check this out. I am going to warn anybody who thinks he has enough influence in his locality to lead a body of facts to snatch boxes or to disturb the voting system. He will do it at the expense of his own life. Breaking news for Harry Tretton's ballot box snatchers with death. Sahara reporters. Is this a military? Well, it is not a military regime, but somehow the statement carry weight gone, it touched me. Mm. However, I feel Mr. Prostitute is trying to instill fear in good norms, thugs, perpetrators, name it, everything that you can imagine. Actually, for anybody who is trying to, you know, rig the, the general elections or even snatch ballot boxes, it is time for you to have a rethink because our pistol is out for you. But like you said, the, the statement mm. was really heavy, really heavy. But then again, you just understand that our president might just have our best interest. What I actually don't understand is the series of comments that have been coming out over time during the whole election saga. First it was Madame mm. Mrs. Um, Erufai, next I was the um, governor, mm. now it is our president. We should watch out what we say. We heard things, a lot of things during this campaign. <laughs> Bam, that is what we can say. In our next episode, we will take it to the street to ask people what to think about President statement as well as poor members' welfare and again, the action uh, that resulted into postponing the general election. 
Yep, we are all here for some rich information on 2019 weekly, so keep it locked.